Okay, so I'm going to be doing a quick demo of some of the work we've been doing here at Collabra uh, with Pulse Audio and Android. Um, what you see here is a Galaxy Nexus, which is the current Google Android developer device. Um, these are server logs from Pulse Audio running on the Galaxy Nexus. Um, basically, what we've done is we've implemented the Audio Flinger playback API um, via Pulse Audio. Um, so, effectively, you can run native apps uh, doing playback and that will go through Pulse Audio. We haven't done uh, capture or uh, policy APIs, and uh, the latter are quite hard, but the playback itself does work. Um, let me quickly show you that uh, this is. Uh, an Android debugger shell on the device and I can list the hardware that Pulse Audio has detected. Um, there is a TI OMAP4 uh, chip in there, that's what it is detected and there is one sync corresponding to this. Um, so you can see there's various ports which correspond to the various output paths. Um, it's currently on the hands-free part which makes the speakers work but there's also a headset path uh, that you can use uh, for um, headphones or speakers when they're plugged into the 3.5mm jack and there are various other uh, ports as well. Um, so let me show you the first thing. Um, there's the clicks that happen with the native UI aren't um, audible on my camera but you can see the stream created here when I unlock the display. Um, the same happens when I click on a button, you can see that there's a stream created. I don't think you can hear the click itself. Um, so let me demonstrate the uh, music player first. Um, let's make a song. Here. I can see around. Pause and play the time. That's just how the song goes. It sounds like drops actually, but yeah. Um, you can skip forward. And you can even see forward like this. There's also videos. You'll notice that uh, trying to play a video has automatically paused the music player. That still works fine as well. Um, this is the um, Sintel movie from the Blender Foundation. Again, I can seek um, however I want. Play and pause work fine. You can actually see AV sync also works fairly decently. another demo play a video of YouTube on the browser the native YouTube application is available on the um, the standard Android open source build So you can actually make up the AV sync a lot better over here. And finally, um, one fun thing that I want to demo is the dialer application. 
tail. This also works. Just fine. And it's pretty responsive too. Yep. So that's all um, Pulse Audio Streams there and it works fairly well now. There's some bits of the API that are still work in progress, things that aren't used very frequently like um, markers and loops and stuff like that. Um, so this is most of the core API, core playback API done. Um, yeah, so that was the demo.